Yes, indeed, folks, it's the illusion of choice. Or, in this case, I suppose you could call it imbecile of the week. It's a simple topic that someone said that was blatant bait for me. It's like dangling a nice piece of raw, bloody meat in front of a snarling, hungry, salivating dog. It's pretty bad. It comes from Panazi, and he says, I thought you might like this. Quote, I did 1k DPS in a heroic and you called me bad for it's such elitism. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't use the $15 a month guy. Oh, you, what, you want me to go off on this guy for 10 minutes? Uh, I suppose I could do that. <laughs> Let's see what he has to say, folks. I'm going to have this linked in the IRC channel if you're not already there. Fools. Fools! IRC.quaintnet.org, hash or pound, WC Radio, and of course, hash or pound, Cynical Brit now. So, let's give this one to Storm Tamer, and he can show it to you. My threads, let me show you them. Right, so, this one is posted by Zaford. So, any anyone that feels like mailing something, perhaps something mean and unreasonable, to Zaford of the House of Ramith on the Corona server US, by all means, f feel free. As far as I'm concerned, if you've got to put your stupid ideas out in public, you deserve everything you get. So, let me emulate, in, in the best possible manner, the voice of Zaford. There's some pretty big issues out there in the community. I really think it's all over the mindset of the community that is going to work things out. But I have a small suggestion. I had hand three instances yesterday of what pretty much accounts for bullying. I was in a random heroic, and the mechanics of the first boss fight left my DPS a little low. Now I had a person come unglued and after telling me the comment, you suck, leave, I'm not carrying no one speech, we went through and eventually I was vote kicked right before the last boss. I'd like a bully report button, because I feel if Blizzard loads you up in a heroic, and you should be able to play as long as you're playing the best you can. Heroic farming should be done with your guild, and if someone is dumping 5k DPS, it's likely the very reason they're running heroics, and not your place to decide how they should play. If you don't want to carry someone, then you should leave, not vice versa. So let's understand. But most people are in heroics to get them done. If you have a beef with someone's GS, keep it to yourself and leave. And if you got a beef with the DPS being done, same thing, leave. I really would like Blizzard to institute the bully button, because often it's the victim of the poor conduct when the perpetrator that suffers. All it has to do is record the chat log and the GM can take care of it on its own sweet time. I feel dirty. Ugh. God, crying. Ah, oh, they're bullying me. Oh, shut up. Crying crying, whining baby. Welcome to the internet, folks! What a show we have coming up for you today! Coming up later on the internet, people can sometimes be mean and unreasonable! Plus, our special feature, people don't like getting their times wasted by horribly geared scrubs that don't know what the hell they're doing with their class. And later, we'll have a special guest, in the form of Scrubby McScrubson, who will whine and cry all over the floor, and the janitor will then clean it up live, on stage! You are invited to throw things at him, preferably heavy, heavy things, maybe with spikes on them. The UK government has lifted its ban on the offensive weapons, including, but not exclusively, chemical rockets and three-pointed shuriken to throw at Zaphod, the House of Ramith, on Corona! Ugh. I hate to be armory police, but let's look at this goddamn guy's gear. Ugh. Oh, he's a moonkin. There's a shocker. <laughs> Always the bloody moonkin. Let's look at how terrible his gear is. It's the... Oh, Jesus. <laughs> wow, that's... Not even that bad. Honestly. Where's your chest in chat? Where's your shoulder in chat? What can... Are you seriously using green gems? Green gems! Blue gems cost nothing! They're like 10 gold! <coughs> oh my god! You're terrible is getting stuck in my throat! Do you understand? 10 gold! It's a purple gem with 10 gold! Why do you use a green? Why would you do this? Oh, it's awful! 
A ward of the Violet Citadel? Are you serious? Oh, I didn't even use that when I was back at the start of Wrath. And to be honest, while that's pretty terrible, there is no way, no way at all, that you should be pulling bad DPS in that gear. Unless you suck. Therein lies the problem. Unless you suck. Yeah, you've got terrible freaking stuff, and you haven't enchanted anything, and your gems are awful, but you still should be able to do reasonable damage in epics. I've seen people in item level 200 out DPS guys in ICC gear. Why? Because the ICC guys sucked. And the guys in the 200s did not. It's as simple as that. So don't give me that nonsense. I'm not, you know, I'm not going to accept it. Oh, we're here to gear, blah, 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 blah. Y you've already got the gear to pull reasonable DPS. If you can pull over 2k, then that's fine. You know what? I, I remember this. I, I was in... I actually joined for the last boss of a Halls of Reflection run, i.e. the chase. So, they'd wiped in there and apparently some guys had left. And, yeah. There's a reason for that. Because they were pulling under 2k DPS on the chase. You want to know the only reason they got through the chase? Me, who was pulling 6.5k with no support from them. Bloody nonsense. Oh, 2k DPS on the freaking chase. Are you serious? You shouldn't have even been there. Nonsense. Utter nonsense. It's the whining and the crying and it's like, Oh, how dare you tell me that I should learn my class. How dare you tell me that I should play ball and be part of the team. Bearing in mind that all the meaningful content in this game is team based. Oh no, no, you, you should carry me through. I pay my $15 a month and somehow that is worth more than yours. Therefore, you should carry me through the instance and give me the gear. And how dare you accuse me of being suboptimal. How dare you? I don't even know what the word optimal means, but I'm sure it's a bad one. <sighs> you know what, folks? This brings out... A real, really ugly side of me. <laughs> Have you guessed? <laughs> why, why, why so whiny? One must ask. To people that actually take this seriously, the crying elitism. And I love that. It's like let's let's throw as much nonsense, let's throw as many populist buzzwords into one title as possible. Bullies, elitist, gear score, DPS. Wow, the only way you can make that more populist is throw in something like slap in the face. <laughs> it's terrible. I mean, look at it. It's awful. Wow. Never listen to these people. <laughs> you know, the, the next guy, it's end of thread right there. Swine flu comes up with this. Only if you put in an easily offended by strangers because I'm a whiny baby butt. Oh, yeah. What? Why is it that I get banned for saying stuff like that on the European forums and yet you can say that on the US ones? Because that's banning material right there. That, that's class that's attempting to humiliate someone, that's actually against the EU forum rules. I can't do that. I have to be more sneaky. <laughs> and then the next one is, or you could do more damage. <laughs> it's a perfect solution, isn't it? Really. If it's that much of a bother to you, then you need to leave the group. I've encountered maybe three jerks total using the LFG system. Then again, I do more than 2k DPS. These guys are great. Oh, I wish they were on the EU forums, honestly. Ah, oh, man. Ah. <sighs> No one has to fake a smile and tell a poor performing person that he's doing fine when he's not. If you know your class, you can do 2k single target and heroics in blues, not item level 232 gear. Yeah, damn right. What more is there to say about that kind of thing? Don't listen to these people. Blizzard should never listen to them. You should never have to listen to them. What? Why waste your time on people like this? You know, you want to be entitled? Then I suggest you be entitled this way. I pay my $15 a month to not play with terrible players like you. I'm not, ob I'm not obliged to play with idiots like you, and I'm certainly not obliged to be nice to you. You're not going to put in the effort. You're going to try and waste my time. You know, wasting someone's time is the most offensive thing you can do in my book. That is the worst thing. It is the worst offense, the worst disrespect. We accept, of course, that the biggest currency in the world, the most important currency in the world, is time. We all have limited time, and I would prefer it not be spent on a moron like yourself. 
So I'm glad that the US forums are willing to tell it like it is. And I'm glad that there are not so many bleeding hearts there that will run to defend this guy. Screaming, ah, how dare you? I dare, they dare, and they certainly well should. It's their right, and indeed their duty, to smack idiots like this down. Because they drag the entire level of the player base. Drag it through the mud. Drag it through the gutter. It's terrible. Horrendous. Ah. Oh, good. Ladies and gentlemen, you've been listening to Blue Please here on WoW Radio. Thank you ever so much for listening to the show. You have, as always, been a fantastic audience. This is the second off last show on WoW Radio. There will be one more next week on the 29th. And then I'll be completing the move over to CynicalBrit.com. You'll also notice that the archives on CynicalBrit.com are being relinked as we speak. All of the new episodes do work. You can note how I've set up the latest episode of Blue Please over there on CynicalBrit.com. It looks great. If I do say so myself, admittedly, it wasn't really my work. That was all Jen's work, so thank you very much for that. You'll notice there, the second page, the second post down, there's a last episode of Blue Please right there. Look at the swanky new bra- banner. The sw- swanky new banner. What? <laughs> swanky new Kenneth banner that Spirit Wolf put together for our site. It's very nice. Doesn't work very well, but hey. And you'll see that we've got some pretty meaty show notes there. Much better set out with links and everything. It's all good, folks. And it's all for you. It is a gift. Shout-out time, folks. You've got a few minutes to get your shout-outs into me. Themolok at gmail.com. That is themolok at gmail.com. Alternatively, tweet me on at Total Biscuit. Or you can send me a message. WC Radio. Hash your pound WC Radio on irc.quaintnet.org. Do it. Do it now. And I shall do your shout-outs for the next few minutes. Thank you ever so much for listening to the show. We do have a tip jar. If you feel like throwing in a couple of dollars to show your appreciation, it's entirely optional and very much appreciated when it happens. PayPal Total Biscuit at gmail.com. And, of course, the other shows have their tip jars as well if you wish to support them and the work that they do. First shout-out goes to Bunkerface. Shout-out to my brother for buying a house and to the guy in my store accusing me of not donating money to Haiti while I did. Yes, I too did that, and I hope that everyone else did so as well. Even if it's just a few dollars, every little helps. Hey TB, Hat Bar from Steam Wheeler Cartel EU here. I'd like to give a shout out to my guild for Realm Second Putricide Kill 25, man. A shout out to for Blizzard and the Lich Slap and the Blood Prince Battle Cry. Naxanar was merely a setback and made my day. And finally, an encouraging shout out for Sec and the rest of the Lemon Cake Guild. I'm sure they will down Putricide this week. There you go, you can have it as requested. Can I shout out to us, Steves and Looper, for finally joining up on RuneScape members for a WoW break? Oh, wow. Why would you do that? And a shout out to you for an awesome website. That's from Steves and Cadgar. I'd like to shout out to my guild, Bird is the Word, on Ravencrest. Family Guy references for the win. I'm pretty sure I actually... Yeah, I'm, yeah, I know I have, in fact. I have had a Bird is the Word guy in my group, in a pug. I'm sure of it. Can I get a shout out to my friend for helping me set up FTP on my RJ45 hard drive? That's from Nymph. Uh, yes, you can. Uh, that's what friends are for, so I'm told. A shout out to Graham because he quit. Wow, we miss you. That's from Chris. Hey, TV. And a sh- uh, shout out to Eric for being epic. I miss you, man. Uh, that's from someone who didn't give me their name. A shout out to me and my guild. Direct workflow for one shotting the first four bosses of ICC 10 and our fourth week together as a guild. That's from, again, someone who didn't give me their name. Ugh. Useless. A shout out to me from Fargrim to Zarina and the guild do. What, really? Just do? On Talvanar EU. Okay, I guess. Uh, the last shout out, the one for the uh, direct workflow guild, was actually for Matt Vela Mern. He's just told me there. And can we get a shout out to getting of the horde? 100,000 honorable kills. Wow. It's from Avatas. <sighs> Crazy. Pretty damn impressive. A shout out to Fergus Halliday for hitting 80 after five years of playing. That took a while, didn't it? Don't worry, there's nothing good here either. A shout out to all the Finnish people listening to WoW Radio and the people in Void Zone at Dra- Bronze Flight Dragon. What's that? Bronze Dragon Flight? Yeah. Dragon Bronze Flight. Whatever, it works. That's from Marcus Tovenen. Can I get a shout out to my godlike guild leader, Saith? He made me say that. <laughs> and all the guys at Premonition Guild of Shattered Halls EU. That's from Patrick McStay. Yes, yes, you can indeed. Ladies and gentlemen, I am out of here. Thank you ever so much for listening. Go check out my new website, cynicalbrit.com. I'll be over there in the next couple of weeks. Keep an eye on WCUAD.com for the proceedings. I am reliably informed there will be a special final show. 
and that will be announced in the coming days. Thank you ever so much. You've been great as always. Check out the rest of our shows on WCRadio.com for the last couple of weeks. And I will see you next Friday, same time, same place, same channel for Blue Please. Good night.